Good morning, Rita. May I have a small latte, please? Sure, Ray. How is everything going? Thank God, I am pretty well. I don't get you. You are always talking about God. I am a Christian, but I don't talk much about God, or spend time reading the Bible. You said you are a Christian? I couldn't imagine it. Well, not your kind of Christian. I do whatever I want. I even have a boyfriend. My husband doesn't know it. They told me it is not a problem. I will still go to heaven. It is true that when someone is saved, is saved forever. Nevertheless, you have to make sure you are truly saved. I raised my hand once. I also prayed the prayer, I am trusting in that. I can do whatever pleases me now, because I cannot go to hell, right? So, for you Christianity is a once in a lifetime event, isn't it? Well, that is not what the Bible teaches. Really? God is love, but he is also holy. The Bible teaches that without holiness, no one will see God. True Christianity is not based on a prayer, but on submission to Jesus. It is like a race that you don't quit. It starts when you repent from your sins, and trust in Jesus. Then what? God puts his spirit within you to help you to overcome sin. In fact, Jesus taught that we can tell a true Christian from a false one, by looking at the way they live. Really? Are you telling me that Christians don't live sinful lives? We are still sinners, but with God's help we become more like Christ every day. That's our goal. I didn't know that. Do you think it is too late for me to become a true Christian? Of course not, if you repent and submit to Jesus. God loves you. Just tell him how you feel. I will. Thanks Ray.